Welcome back. This is KCAL News Mornings at 9. That's right. There's a lot going on here on KCAL News Mornings at 9. Police are trying to find a dog that was violently taken from its owner. It's a terrible story. Mm -hmm. KCAL News reporter Rick Montanez is live in North Hollywood with photos that detectives want you to see, Rick, because they're still looking for this dog. Yeah, Sheba, Jamie, I talked with LAPD. They are still looking for him. But I also talked with the friend of the victim who says she was badly beaten in this attack. And now they're trying to raise money online because apparently the injuries are so bad the victim will be out of work for a couple of weeks. And she's still looking for her dog. That attack happened here at the 7-Eleven behind me on Burbank Boulevard. Check out the photos here. These are the photos of the dog, Drake, who is missing right now. A pit bull Rhodesian mix, uh, Rhodesian Ridgeback mix, I should say. An 11-year-old dog stolen from his owner by force on Tuesday morning just before 1 a.m. Police say the attack was seemingly unprovoked. The victim's friend says she was heading inside to use the ATM with Drake in tow, and that's when she was ambushed, her friend wrote online, kicked and punched punched by both suspects. LAPD released the photos of the two people they're looking for. A woman dressed in all black. The victim's friend says that woman and the man she was with beat the victim and ripped Drake out of her hands. Both suspects, it appears, walked in after the victim at the 7-Eleven on Burbank Boulevard and Fulcher Avenue. Local dog rescuer Chris Kelly says she's angry learning about this attack, and she unfortunately has seen this far too often. People know there are no consequences anymore, so they're stealing just any anything. Dogs, uh, clothing, uh, bags from people, and they just doing it brazenly. They knew a camera was on them from the phone. They don't care. They know they're not going to get in trouble. So the victim's friend tells me she was actually treated at the hospital. She's home now recovering, but they are also overwhelmed and grateful by the community support that they've received. Of course, the desperate hope right now is that they find Drake safe and sound. Reporting live in North Hollywood, Rick Montanez, KCAL News. I think that's what we're all hoping. I oh, know. Rick, thank you.